Hey there everybody, T-Shirt Booth here for GSHelper.com and in this video I'm going to show you how to pick a random number from a set of numbers. So not between 1 and 10, let's say you want a random number between 2, 4, 6, 8, and 10. Uh, I'm going to show you how to do that real quick, it's super simple now with tables. Um, let's dig right in. So I'm going to hit home and we're going to go into tables and we're going to create a new table by hitting the plus sign. I'm going to go into the table and let's go ahead and add five columns and each one of these is going to be integer and we'll go ahead and add our number in here so this one's going to be two four six oops, six eight and 10. So now we're going to go home, scene, and we're going to create a new actor. I'll put it on here. And we're going to go into this actor. And what we're going to do is we're going to say cr create a rule. When touch is pressed, we want to um, change an attribute. So let's change here. Um, Let's add an attribute to our self attributes here, and we'll make a index attribute, <clears throat> and we'll call it number. So we're going to change attribute, self, number, and now we need to pull a cell value. Um, so what we're going to do is we'll use the um, table cell value um, expression. And under table, we're going to erase the word table. And we're going to add our table, which is table 1. And for row, we know the number um, is in the first row. So we're just going to put a 1 there. Now for column, because we want a random number from one of our numbers, we're going to use the expression editor and we're going to choose uh, random. And then just click over here and move this way. And for minimum, um, we're going to choose 1 because we want to start on column 1 um, to a maximum and we know we have 5 columns so I'm just going to add a 5 there um, traditionally we could go in here instead of putting 5 we could put uh, um, table column count and grab the column count that way um, but for, um, for this I'm just going to put 5 I'm going to hit OK and now I'm going to put a display text in here and we're going to tell it to display our self attribute. And I'm going to change the color here. And I'm going to press preview. So now you'll see when I click it, it's going to change to a number. Click it again. 3, 4, 6, 10, 8, 2, 8. So it's just choosing numbers from the numbers that I chose. There was a 3 in there, so I'm just going to go and check my table. Make sure I didn't add a 3 in there somewhere. I did. So this is supposed to be a 4. Uh, there we go. Preview again. Click. So now it's only choosing random numbers from the, um, the set numbers that we've chosen. So that's all you need to know about choosing random numbers from a set amount of numbers in Game Salad. Uh, please like the video, thumbs up it, uh, subscribe, do all that stuff. Head on over to gshelper.com for tons of more free videos, and I'll see you guys again soon.